It's down to the wire in a heated primary race for governor. Good evening, I'm Leah Lando. Both claim the mantle of reformer and conservative tax cutter, but the voters appear to be evenly divided between GOP gubernatorial contenders Rick Lazio and Carl Palladino tonight. News Force George Rickard has the home stretch in this primary tug and pull. George. Please, the next governor of the state of New York, Carl Palladino. At Casanova Park in South Buffalo, 300 supporters turned out to rally for Carl Palladino on the eve of the Republican primary. A Siena College poll now has Palladino in a statistical dead heat with 42% of the Republican vote compared to 43% for Rick Lazio from Long Island, where Palladino also campaigned over the weekend. I found out that they're all just like us. I'm voting for his fresh approach. It's no nonsense, stands on things, and the fact that he's willing to make a lot of changes. Palladino has a plan to cut state spending by 20% and cut taxes by 10%. Lazio plans to create a million private sector jobs in five years. I've been in contract with America, Congressman. I've, I was on the budget committee that wrote the first balanced budget. I've always voted to lower taxes. Palladino spent the day hosting rallies from Batavia to Rochester to Niagara Falls before ending at this largest one in South Buffalo. I think the momentum's behind him. It's like a horse race, and you can see it at the end. Who's going to cross the finish line? It's going to be Carl. If you don't win tomorrow, will you stay on? We will win tomorrow. There's no question about it. We're going to win tomorrow. Palladino petitioned to create the new Taxpayers Party, which he can also run on in November. Democrat Andrew Cuomo has no primary challenger tomorrow. Live at Election Central, George Rickard for the 10 o'clock news. Thank you, George.